Hello friends. Welcome to Gelco World. Today we have Gelco DCP7201DW A single phase panel which has an inbuilt water level controller facility. So for set up it, first open the panel's door. Now we will check the normal rated current of motor or pump. Press the green button to turn on the pump. On the display, we can see the voltage and current of the motor or pump. This is the normal rated current of motor or pump. We needs this normal rated current value during the parameter setting. Now stop the pump by pressing the red button. With the help of screwdriver, press set button for 4 to 5 seconds. Overload option will appear on the display. You have to keep overload value 20% higher than the normal rated current of the pump. So we will set the overload value to 14.4 ampere. Press the set button after the value is selected. Now dry run option will appear on the display. The value of dry run protection should be 20% less than the normal rated current of the pump. So we will set the dry run value to 9.6 ampere. Press the set button after the value is selected. Overload and dry run parameters are set in the panel. Now we will see how to do sensor connections. If you have only one water tank, then you have to short and need to loop C U H U L and place C sensor at the bottom level of the water tank. Place the OL sensor at the middle level of water tank and place the OH sensor at higher level of the water tank and set the switch on auto mode. If you have two water tanks, so in underground water tank, place the C sensor at bottom level of water tank. Place the UL sensor at the middle level of water tank and place the UH sensor at the higher level of water tank. Now we will see the connection of the sensors in overhead water tank. Place the C sensor at the bottom level of water tank. Place the OL sensor at the middle level of water tank. And place the OH sensor at the higher level in water tank. And set the switch on auto mode. Thank you for connecting with Gelco. For more information please visit our website.